Virginia State Parks, the treasure chest of the Commonwealth. From the Blue Ridge Mountains to the Atlantic Ocean, from the Shenandoah Valley to the Chesapeake Bay, Virginia State Parks are natural, cultural, and recreational treasures offering something for everyone. Thousands of campsites and hundreds of cabins, more than 350 miles of trails, and a wide range of stimulating and educational activities, workshops, festivals, programs, concerts, and natural wonders. In 1933, as the nation struggled in the throes of the Great Depression, President Roosevelt created the Civilian Conservation Corps, a program intended to put to work half a million unemployed young men in forests, parks, and rangelands across the country. The CCC built more than 40,000 bridges, planted two billion trees, improved thousands of beaches, roads, and shorelines, and created 800 state parks, including the first six in Virginia. On June 15, 1936, just three years after the CCC began, Virginia simultaneously opened six state parks. Douthat, Westmoreland, Hungry Mother, Fairy Stone, Stanton River, and Seashore, now First Landing. The CCC also helped develop what would become Pocahontas, Holiday Lake, Bear Creek, and Twin Lakes State Parks. Virginia was the first state to open an entire park system on the same day. The new parks offered modern outdoor recreational facilities while protecting areas with significant natural resources. Today, the original six park system has grown to include more than three dozen parks and historic sites and continues to grow. Each has unique natural or historical resources that are carefully managed and preserved by the Virginia Department of Conservation and Recreation. Voted America's Best Managed in 2001 by the Sports Foundation at the National Recreation and Park Association Annual Meeting, Virginia State Parks are not only the best managed system in the United States, but they're special places where we can leave behind the daily pressures of life and reconnect with nature with our families, and with our past. Every Virginia State Park is special, reflecting each unique region of the Commonwealth. For example, Natural Tunnel State Park. Thought by some to be formed around one million years ago, Natural Tunnel has been a tourist attraction for more than a hundred years. Located in one of the westernmost counties of Virginia, Natural Tunnel has been called the eighth wonder of the world since William Jennings Bryan first used the phrase to describe this spectacular formation. Since opening in 1948 in nearby Big Stone Gap, the Southwest Virginia Museum chronicles the region's unique history and the nation's expansion westward with a variety of permanent and special exhibits. The most visited state park in the Commonwealth, First Landing State Park, is a natural oasis in the city of Virginia Beach. With cabins, campgrounds, and tranquil beaches on the Chesapeake Bay, First Landing is a popular vacation spot year after year. Listed on the National Register of Natural Landmarks since 1965, First Landing is the site where the Jamestown settlers set foot in the New World for the first time. In northern Virginia, a short drive from the nation's capital, Lee Sylvania State Park offers access to the Potomac River while preserving historic sites spanning hundreds of years of U.S. history. Nestled in the Allegheny Mountains of Virginia, Douthat State Park has remained virtually unchanged since opening in 1936. 
listed on the National Register of Historic Places, Douthat boasts some of Virginia's most outstanding scenery, as well as swimming, boating, and seasonal fishing. And no matter where you go in Virginia, you're never too far from a state park. Your visit to a Virginia State Park doesn't have to end at sundown. There are more than 200 cabins across the park system. Fully furnished with central air conditioning and heat, the cabins have full kitchens and even microwaves. But you won't find televisions or telephones to disturb the natural serenity and beauty. For larger groups, consider a family lodge, which can sleep as many as 15 to 18 people. Of course, camping has always been popular in Virginia State Parks. And with more than 1,600 campsites across the state, ranging from primitive to sites with water and electrical hookups for your RV. No matter what your activity, Virginia State Parks are a vital part of a healthy lifestyle and serve as a therapeutic tonic for the mind, body, and spirit. But the parks are much more than natural playgrounds. The cultural and historical opportunities are endless. Virginia State Parks interpret the history of Virginia from 14th century native Virginians through the colonial and Civil War eras to today. Nature programs in all the parks give visitors the opportunity to learn about the natural world up close and personal. Supported by an army of volunteers and dedicated staff, Virginia State Parks host around 7 million visitors each year. Virginia State Parks and Natural Areas also offer a wide variety of career opportunities. Today, Virginia State Parks continue to grow with the construction of new cabins, campgrounds, and facilities, as well as the regular maintenance and restoration of historic sites. By continuing the stewardship and award-winning management that has helped make Virginia State Parks so successful, our state parks will continue to be Virginia's shining jewels well into the 21st century.